Oh, that was Dial. Whoa! We defeated Commander Kamado, who is trying to be in our way. We're about to enter this temple. <gasps> I'm excited. Ready? Maybe I should get some Pokemans ready. We'll just get Umbreon ready. Okay, we're going in. We're going in. <gasps> Look at this. This is so cool. Oh my gosh. These are all the lords that I've defeated. Or not defeated. We've quelled their frenzy. Frenzies. Look at them. I love them. <gasps> I love them. Oh my goodness. This is so cool. <gasps> What's going to happen? Time to use the red chain. Let's see what it can do. <gasps> Hold on a sec. My head. Something's talking inside my head. <gasps> oh, God. You hold the red chain. Try to catch me then, human. <gasps> uh, Adamant, what are you saying? What do you mean, catch you? <gasps> Almighty Sinnoh? I, I think Almighty Sinnoh just spoke to me. This is crazy. It's telling me... You hold the red chain. Try to catch me then, human. For the fight to come. What does this mean? Take these. What? <gasps> Ultra balls? Am I going to try to catch a Pokemon? Like, I'm going to try to capture you? What? <gasps> oh, she's so determined. Did you break it? <gasps> Why did you break it? Woo! Why did you break it? Oh god, I'm I'm battling it. There's no way. <laughs> There's no way. Oh god. Okay. Um well. That ah, stop. Okay. <laughs> look at how crazy majestic you are. Okay. Hey, look at that. Hey, look at that. Hey, look at that. Good job, Umbreon. Umbreon's gone. I'm sorry, Umbreon. I'm so sorry. Uh you did a good amount of damage to, to him though, which is nice. Do we have some like very effective things? No. Um, we're bringing out nine tails right away, though. <clears throat> Bro. Look at nine tails. Nine tails can definitely stand up to you. For sure. You're so cool. You're so cool. <laughs> I feel like I'm in the presence of a god. I do. Okay, fire blast. <gasps> yeah. Yeah. Oh, I gotta do it again. Heck yes. Heck yes. I have a feeling this is not going to be... <gasps> I was supposed to try to catch it. Get out of there, regroup. I was supposed to try to catch it. <laughs> Or what that Pokemon said to me. Try to catch me. I know. I'm sorry. <laughs> if you have the strength to defeat it, surely you'll be able to catch it as well. Okay. I got this. I got this. I got this. I got this. Um. Yes. Try to catch me. Okay. I kill you. We got this. I'm going to catch him. <laughs> Ah. 
Sorry. That could have been over with. Over and done with. Go on, Brian! Okay. What did I do the first time? It's probably not going to work out exactly. But. Heck yes. You did. Heck yes, you avoided the attack. Good job, Umbreon. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. <gasps> eee! Ooh, okay. Ha ha ha. I'm gonna do this again. Okay. Okay. Everyone, yay! Let's do this. Uh, we're not gonna do a strong style one. Nine tells you you're so beautiful. We're gonna do this one so it doesn't get you all the way. <gasps> no! 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 Okay, okay. Uh, throw it. Yes. I did it! I caught the god Pokemon. She caught it. I caught the god Pokemon. You're too powerful. I'm too powerful! The red chain has shattered, but we owe the Pokemon of the Lakes our thanks for getting us this far. <gasps> well done, Celestria, my girl. Masterfully handled. I was watching the whole time as you battled and caught your way to a simply stunning victory. You truly are the pride of the Survey Corps. <laughs> it's all because she had me to show her the ropes when she first got here. <laughs> That's cute. Wait, it's happening again. I can hear Almighty Sinnoh. No, no, it's called Dialga. Mighty Dialga speaking to me in my mind. From my Pokeball? Space time is torn. Awful power spills forth. The frenzied one comes to fight. Now, human, fight it with me! <gasps> Am I gonna fight alongside Dialga? You're telling me there's another one? This is so crazy, you guys. I'm like so invested in this right now. I'm so giddy and excited right now. But the red chains smash to bits. No way even Celestria could tackle another Pokemon as strong as that last one now. But I have Dialga on my side though. We can fight it together! Dialga's not the bad Pokemon. Oh god! Ah! Are you the enemy? You're the enemy! You're the enemy! Oh my god! Bro, this is so crazy. I can do it! Why are we running? <laughs> What is that? Ah! Come on, Dialga, let's fight together. All of you, we must vacate this. Gah, forget the fancy talk. Book it, come on. We gotta make it back to the summit camp while we still can. We need to leave before this all, before this other almighty Seno decides it wants to fight us. But Commander, we can't just leave it here. You dunce. <laughs> You don't be any use to anybody if you die up here on this mountain. What are you waiting for? I'm telling you, we gotta get gone. <laughs> the way he talks is funny. <laughs> I can do it. Oh, we left. We left. We left. We're regrouping. We did leave. Okay. Sh such dreadful power. It's certainly beyond our current ca capabilities to survey this creature. To survey such a creature. I'm amazed you even managed to stay on your feet before it, Celestria. And did you notice the energy pouring out of the rift? It seems likely that a buildup of the same energy was what caused the strange lightning that threw the noble Pokemon into their frenzied states. Please tell me I don't have to quell them again. <laughs> I can't believe there are really two Almighty Sinnoh after all. Guess that means neither of our clans was really wrong, huh? I must apologize from the bottom of my heart. To the both of you as fellow leaders. You saw the truth that I could not. You never abandoned your trust in Celestria. Haha. <laughs> Can't believe you did, though, Kamado. I'm salty at you. 
And to you, Celestria. I acted on ill-considered presumptions and dove, drove you from the Galaxy Expedition Team, forcing you to face great hardship alone. And despite all of that, you still strove to save all of Hisui. I don't forgive you. Celestria might, but I don't. Well, it's not like we could just sit back and ignore the space-time rift. And we understood, Commander, that you had reasons to act as you did. Commander, might I suggest we return to the matter at hand? We've left things in quite a state up at the temple. That's the stuff, Mr. Professor. You'd rather face what's in front of us than dwell on the past, huh? Just what I'd expect from a real scientist. <laughs> a dependable attitude, indeed. Yes, let's let us move on. No need to speak any further about my rash actions, not to mention my loss of composure. It seems that having Celestria about has been a good influence on all. Thank goodness you were here, huh? We'd have had no chance getting through this disaster without you. We're still not through it. How is she to keep fighting? The red chain is shattered. Relax, I've got a plan. Thanks to what almighty Dialga told me. Dialga? The Pokemon that spoke to you? Yeah, and along with its name. It also told me what we need. <gasps> the stone of creation's beginning. The chain of red. The vessel of humankind's invention. Unite these three and calm the chaos now. The chaos now pervading space. We need two more things? Oh my god, when is this gonna end? <laughs> Not that I don't enjoy the story, but I thought that was going to be the end. Um, and finally, Almighty Dialga said it wants to go with us back to the temple. If the red chain we have... Wait, well, the red chain we have at least. The pieces anyway. I did collect them. Okay, sounds good. Um, in the Vessel of Humankind's Invention, I dare say that might refer to a Pokeball. Okay. That's got to be it. But what about the part of the Stone of Creation's beginning part? Leon might have some idea. He's knowledgeable about stones and minerals. He even goes digging for ore sometimes. Is that so? Then Ward and Leon will be a fine resource to consult. Okay. Um, and what are your thoughts, Professor Leventin? Do you have any idea what this stone could be? Hmm. I dare say. Oh. Upon my word, perhaps I do. Celestria, my girl. Don't call me that. Could you lend me those plates you received from Weirdier and the others? Oh! I keep forgetting that I've gotten plates from all of them. Um, the ones that Volo said had messages engraved upon them. <gasps> I forgot about this. I forgot about this. Aha. Just as I remembered. Here on the back of the Earth plate it says, When the universe was created, its shards became this plate. <gasps> I think this may be a hint to what we need. What do you mean? Don't you see? We must search for stone, or rather ore, I suppose, that shares the same material properties as these plates. In fact, I believe that young Leon might know just where to find such a thing. As he said, he'd been investigating it at Volo's urging. Now that you mention it, that Volo fellows come around the diamond settlement asking about those plates before too. It seems like a lead worth following. Let's do it. It's decided then. Thus begins our search for the stone of creation's beginning. A whole nother thing we have to do. <laughs> Although the name is rather a mouthful, wouldn't you say? I propose we call it Origin Ore. That's cool. I like that. Yay. Origin Ore. Yerda, may we ask for your clan's aid once more? Of course. <laughs> I'll call Leon to the summit camp at once. I waited as long as anyone could reasonably expect, but my invitation just never came. Oh, pfft, it's Melly. <laughs> That's funny. So I decided to honor you with an unsolicited visit. Be glad and rejoice. So funny. Now, Adaman, I see all these other louts have their little tasks to be getting on with. But what of great Melly? Where's my role in all of this? <laughs> He's like so unimpressed. I'm your leader, Melly. Show us shred... Show a shred of respect, would you? Fine, whatever. Just hurry up and give me a job. Great leader, Adaman. And make it a good one. 
You want a job? Fine. Your job is to support the others. All the other wardens are busy looking after their nobles and keeping the people of our clans from panicking. Take a hint. <laughs> oh, Adam man. Oh, oh, oh. You silly, foolish boy. Don't you understand anything? Everyone has work they are suited to and work they are not. <laughs> and oh, before I forget, it seems you weren't entirely useless after all, Galaxy Team Grunt. Well done, you. You're so nice, Millie. <laughs> Take this as a reward for your adorable efforts. <laughs> Just my way of encouraging the little people. And you're all so little compared to me. <laughs> Candy troubles, yay. Um, packed full of mysterious energy. It's one of the materials needed for crafting various items. I wonder if I need this for something important or if it's just for funsies. What's up, Leon? I brought Leon. Yeesh, that ugly hat suits you as poorly as this important role does. I don't like this at all. I should be the one consulted for my wisdom. Hisui's ores and stones are her precious resource. Since I was the first to realize that fact, it's only natural that I should be the first consulted. If you have a problem with it, perhaps you'd like to take it up with Cleaver in battle. With that bumbling ball of yours. <laughs> Excuse me? That bumbling ball is more than <laughs> capable of zapping both you and that ugly bug of yours all the way back to your stu stupidly oversized tree. <laughs> Shall we prove it to you now? <laughs> Melly, give it a rest and play nice with the Pearl Clan folks for once, would you? Bigger things are at stake here. But Adaman, <laughs> everyone back home is all worked up about the fact you were spoken to by Almighty Sinnoh or Mighty Dialga or whatever. This is the Diamond Clan's day. Be proud. Warden Leon, if you would. <laughs> Certainly. Let, then let us set out at once. We make for the primeval grotto. Okay, head for the place where you can obtain origin ore. That sounds really cool. Ready? 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 Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. All right. Oh, excuse me. Excuse you. I'm gonna go this way. Um, you know, I honestly could. There we go. I forget that I have this dude. I don't remember how to. Uh, yeah. Oh, this isn't that far, right? Or is it around there or underneath there? Do I need to go into the mountain? Do I need to go into there? Is there a way to go under? Oh, there we go. There is a really big... There's a really big Pokemans right there. Oh, oh. Okay. <gasps> Don't get me! Hi! Hello, excuse me. <laughs> excuse me, I'm just trying to get through. Trying to get through. Okay, we gotta fight. No? Okay. We're good. What a curious cave. I feel some extraordinary power here, as if the world itself was created in this very place. Oh, that's cool. What do you think, Leon? Taking into consideration my knowledge of ores, my skill at mining, and the strength of my sligoos moves. <laughs> I think you'd better leave any extraction work up to us, wouldn't you say? Sure. Go for it. That doesn't sound fun to me at all. We're gonna have to ask you to stop right there. <gasps> Who? Oh my god, really? We haven't seen these in, these guys in forever. Oh, come on, who's there? <laughs> we don't have any time to waste with... Ugh. Clover? We haven't seen you since you walked out on the clan. Where have you been all this time? I forgot about these girls completely. <laughs> this is like the Team Rocket of this game, by the way. Um, I don't have to tell you nothing. <laughs> Look, you can carry on digging out that treasure you're after. And then you'll give it to us. I don't know why you've even looked surprised. Why you even look surprised. It's not as if you were hard to follow. Uh, what we seek may be as precious as treasure, but this isn't about how valuable it is. We need it to restore this awful sky to normal. That Ernest Goody Two-Shoes act of yours is what made me leave the Pearl Clan in the first place. 
Enough I don't care why any of you ran off to play Bandit. But I won't let you get in Leon's way. There are three of you and three of us. Let's go, Celestria. You take charm. <laughs> All right. Are we battling, really? Oh, God. I bring good luck to my sisters wherever I go. And ill luck to anyone who crosses our path. I'm the eldest, and I'll be your unlucky charm. Oh, I didn't read the rest of that. I accidentally pressed the button. It was her little slogan, anyways. Okay, let's go, charm. Jeez. Uh, at least I don't have to battle all three of them. Like I did last time we saw them. Okay. Let's go. Um, let's do a really strong dark pulse. How about... Boop. Bam. Alright, we're good, we're good, we're good. Oh shit. I forgot if I used a strong style. Okay, I'm just gonna do a regular one. Yay! What else you got? You got one more? I think she's only using two right now. Gengar! I love you. It sucks that you have to be... belong to a... stupid person bad person. Okay. Go Shadow Ball. Boop. Ha 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 ha. <laughs> Sorry, Gengar. Yay. You are rather formidable. <laughs> Yay. Adopt Gengar. Give it the life it deserves. I wish. Come on, Clover. Why not come back to the Diamond Clan? Times are changing. We're changing. And we could really use someone as strong as you are. Are you joking? I've got no interest in living back in that place with all its stupid rules. <laughs> Look, we'll let you keep your treasure this time. But you'd better do something about that sky. You are as strong as ever, Celestria. Maybe you really can do something about that monstrous creature at the top of the mountain. But even if you do... The next time we meet, you won't escape without a beating. Remember that. <laughs> oh, God. Honestly, those three. <laughs> what did they even come here for? Oh, well, I'll heal up everyone's Pokemon. Thank you. Yay. The coin that I remember never hesitated to help someone in need, even if she growls as she did so. <laughs> I suspect they may have been worried about us, perhaps even wanting to help. Huh. Then they should have just said so. What a pain they are, hiding behind all that attitude. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. Look at the goopy guy. Look at you, you're cute. I was able to extract some of that origin ore, or whatever it is you wish to call it. I suppose you had, it had better go with you, Celestia. <laughs> Yay! Origin Ore. An ore of mysterious power spoken of in ancient myths and said to contain the power of almighty Sinnoh itself. <gasps> that was surprisingly easy. No, you simply failed to recognize my skill. You ought to be praising my hard work, honestly. <laughs> I know we could count on you, Leon. No wonder Cleaver recognizes you as a worthy warden. Let's hurry back to Mr. Professor and show him what we got. That Leventon's got sound judgment. Got sound judgment. Plus knowledge to spare, despite his silly streak. That's very true. Report back to Professor Leventon with the iron. Hello! I want to go around in here at some point. Because this is new, I believe. No! I don't want to fight right now. I just want to go back. Okay, we got this. Song is goaded. <laughs> All right, what do you got? So this is the stone of creation's being, the origin ore. Yes, one can certainly feel an imposing aura emanating from it. Could this be the feeling of the very origin itself? <gasps> I've been meaning to ask since you brought that up, but the origin of what exactly? Of everything by the sound of it. Exactly, my girl. 
<laughs> now then, back we go to Jubilee Village. Ooh, let's go. Okay, back to Jubilee Village. Here you are, Professor Leventon. What remains of the red chain, broken as it may be. Here you go. Splendid. Even in pieces, I think we'll find it still perfectly fits the purpose. Okay. Um, we're jolly lucky you had the foresight to pick up all these broken bits back at the temple. You're up next, Celeste. You got time for uh, whatever we're calling that stone. <laughs> the origin ore. I did hand over the origin ore. Okay. The fragments of the red chain collected at great personal risk by the Pearl Clan. Then the stone of creation's beginning, which we first learned of thanks to the Diamond Clan. Look at us all working together. And now it is time for the Galaxy team to play its part and turn these items into a proper vessel. <gasps> Are we turning it into a Pokeball? For to catch, for to catch the other one? <laughs> Ray, my boy, you are one of our team's greatest craftspeople. Can I ask you to do the honors? <gasps> That's exciting. That's exciting! Just wait, Celestia. You'll finally see what I'm truly capable of. This may take us some time. Perhaps the rest of you had best wait outside while we work. <gasps> craft, craft, craft. Craft, craft, craft. <laughs> Is he talking to you again? Oh, come on, Mr. Professor. I wish I'd hurry it up in there. He just does this a lot. <laughs> I'm starting to suspect all of our prattling about the value of time is a cover for your own impatience. If sitting back and waiting actually solved things, I'd sit forever because that would be using time well, unlike this. <laughs> oh, we're all so anxious. We've done it, Celestria. It's complete. <gasps> I dub it the origin ball. Ah! If the message conveyed to our good clan leader can be believed. Wait. If the message conveyed to our good clan leader can be believed, then this should allow you to catch the Pokemon that has appeared at the Temple of Sinnoh. Haha, I knew it. Oh, so cool. So cool. Let's go battle it. <gasps> Ooh, look at that. That looks so cool. You obtained the Origin Ball. <gasps> A singular and irreplicable... Pokeball that can be used to catch the frenzied Pokemon raging at the Temple of Sinnoh. <gasps> Bro. These Pokeballs of yours are full of wonders. To think that fate of all Hisui could rest in something so tiny, but so powerful. It's interesting how catching a Pokemon in one of these things brings the two of you closer together. Whoa, hold on. It's that voice. I hear it in my head again. You mean Dialga? Yeah. Seems like Mighty Dialga is willing to lend its strength to, to this fight. That's what it's telling me. That's certainly excellent news. The Diamond Clan's Almighty Sinnoh, or perhaps I should say Dialga, is fearsomely powerful. Everything's ready now, Celestria. Oh my gosh. Take the Origin Ball and hurry back to the Temple of Sinnoh together with Dialga. Ah! I'm so excited. <laughs> I'm so excited! Um, okay, we're continuing on. Load, load, load. Let's go. <gasps> oh, it's that lady! She came to the village. Alright, we're moving on. We're moving along. We got a whole hour left to see how far we can get. And here you are, lost one, ready to face your fate atop Mount Cornet. Seems a vicious battle might await you. <gasps> I'll go where I must. I'm so brave. Oh, well said. Now hearken, hearken to my words, young ones. <laughs> what is that word? Time cannot be severed from space, nor space from time. <gasps> the being you will encounter at the Temple of Sinnoh is Palkia. Ruler of all space. So Diaga is time. And Palkia is space. If it is allowed to run wild, space itself will warp and bend here in Hisui. And eventually, the very world may be broken. <gasps> but you have the aid of its counterpart, Dialga. The ruler of time. And therein lies hope. Yay! Balance will be brought to time and space. And the world can once again be as it should. Now take Dialga at your side and make for the Temple of Sinnoh once more. 
Yay, let's go! Uh... Yes, I know! Why did it tell me to go? I'm trying to leave. <laughs> That's what I'm trying to do. Am I missing something here? Do I not have the ball? This is where I'm supposed to go! What is happening here? <laughs> That's literally the... You need Dialga in your party. Oh! I didn't know that I didn't! Okay, silly head of me. <laughs> I didn't realize that I didn't. <laughs> That's silly. Okay, who do we gotta boot? Um, no, I don't wanna boot on Brian. Okay, 52, 52, 52. Okay, um... Gold duck, sorry. Because Hunter is my favorite. I love Hunter. Okay. Oh, you're so cool. You're so cool. <laughs> you're so cool. Okay. That makes a lot of sense. <laughs> like, why? I thought he was just automatically with me for some reason. All right, let's go. Okay. Hello. Yes. I already read this. Okay, cool. I have Dialga now. I thought that I already had him, but I didn't. But now I do. Now we're ready to go. Yes, let's go. I must say, this is quite the intriguing village. Perhaps I'll look around before I go. See what your clothier has to offer. <laughs> Excuse me, is this the time for shopping? <laughs> well, I'll hardly have time for shopping if the world ends, will I, young man? I mean, fair point. <laughs> He said fair point. That's funny. <laughs> I don't know what happened. I thought we were going on to a loading screen, but I think I kicked the thing. Anyways. <laughs> that was really funny. Um, all right, Celestria, once you feel ready, set out. We make for the Temple of Sinnoh once more. Let's go. Let's go. Yee! Okay. Now we can leave. Um, let's go. I'm so excited. Heading out of the village? Yes. <gasps> um, I don't know what's closest actually, to be honest. No, I definitely kicked where my um, console is sitting on, so that's what made it go black. Can I just like take? Wait, 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 wait. Okay, I wanna make sure. No, we're good. Yeah, we're good. Let's go! Let's go, Braviary! I don't know if I can go any higher. Dash. <gasps> oh! Nope. Okay, go up though. Up though. Forward. Thank you. Forward. Can you go up? Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> sneeze right now! <laughs> you need sneeze <laughs> That was funny. Okay. <laughs> Um, we'll just make our way this way. It's fine. We'll get there. We'll get there. It's fine. Don't attack me. Don't attack me. <laughs> that was a mess. Oh, come on. Okay. There we go. There we go. Look. Look at... We can just cut across the landscape now with all of my different... With all of my different mount Pokemans. <laughs> Whoa, Steelix. Sneezler. I wish Skyrim Mountains were this easily climbable. I know, you just need a Sneezler. You just need to put Sneezler in Skyrim. Stop it. I'm just trying to get past here, okay? I'm trying to save the world. Please just leave me alone. Can I fast travel there? If I can fast travel there, <laughs> that's gonna be ridiculous. You know what? We came this far, it's fine. We can take a little break from the- Whoa! We can take a little break from the- Here we go. Okay. We'll just go through here, right? And up to the top. The music is getting eerie. And intense. Volo, hello. Just 
the girl I've been waiting for. <laughs> I love Olo. Um, I know you can buy various sundries at the base camp, but I thought it might be helpful to you if I set up here closer to the temple. Okay, sounds good. I want to have front row seats if there's a chance to see into the world of myth and legend. I'll probably be creeping even closer to the action once the battle actually begins. But you don't have to worry about me. I'm perfectly capable of taking care of myself. Okay. And besides, I know all too well the strength of you and your Pokemon. I've got no doubt that you'll have this whole thing tied up in a neat bow before I could possibly be in any danger. <laughs> Sounds good. I don't think I need anything from you right now, though. I think I'm prepared. I think I have enough stuff. Oh my gosh, I'm nervy. Nervy, nervy. This has to be the end of the game. Is it going to be like super crazy of a battle? Like, is it going to be super hard? Because Dialgo is easy. Right? I wonder if this one's going to be super hard. But I have Dialga to fight, though. On my side. <gasps> this is so cool. Okay. Let's go. For so long, I thought that I had to eliminate any outside element that might threaten the people of Jubilee Village. Whether that meant banishing you or seeking to destroy the Pokemon of the temple, I felt it was my only path. But you've shown me that I was wrong to think in such a way. Good. <laughs> Are you ready for this challenge, Recruit? I am. I'm ready to fight. <gasps> With a smile. <laughs> hey, Celestria, let's meet tomorrow together. <gasps> we will. We're gonna. What is that supposed to mean? I'm saying we've got... Wait, it's a saying we've got in the Diamond Clan. It means you hope you'll both stay safe. <gasps> we'll see each other tomorrow. Perhaps it's worth listening to what the Diamond Clan has to say sometimes as well. <laughs> we will support you in whatever way we can, though I doubt you'll need it. Celestria, protect Hisui and her people. Protect time and space for her Pokemon. I will. This is intense. The whole world is literally on my shoulders right now. <laughs> you got this. We got this. That wasn't the origin ball. <gasps> oh, that was Dialga. Whoa! That was crazy! This is so intense! <gasps> okay. Dialga, I choose you! This is so cool. This is so intense. Oh my god. Whoa! I'm like speechless. I'm speechless. <laughs> oh my god! Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Did you just teleport? Did you just teleport at me? Oh, oh, get out. Oh my god. Oh, get out, get out, get out. Oh, oh my god. Bro. Oh god. I'm getting really rocked. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh. Oh, 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 oh. This is so intense, you guys. This, um, may... No! This might get up there on list of favorite games. What a cool ending this has been. It's so intense. 
Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh my gosh, send the Pokemon into battle. Uh, who? Who? You! Can I not? Really? Oh god. Did I wait too late? I don't know if I can just send out the Alga. Maybe I can't. Maybe I have to send out everyone else first. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> I took one wrong step. One wrong step. Okay, everything went black. We're gonna continue where we were. Uh, continue battle. We're fine. We'll keep going. Uh, keep, keep previous progress. We're good. We can keep the the gauge. You almost had a first try. I know. I'm really sad that I didn't. I'm really sad that I didn't first shot that. <laughs> Who? Who? <laughs> Dang it. Oh, 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 oh. Ooh. Hooey. 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 Oh, shit. Surely. <gasps> I got you. Oh, oh. What? Oh. I got him. <gasps> I called you frenzy. You were frenzied. It's okay. It's okay. You were just frenzied. That's it. I know you're not bad. I just got like the chills. <laughs> oh, we did it. But what now? I don't want them to just be captured. They need to be time and space. She, she caught it. She really did it, didn't she? My eyes aren't lying, right? She actually went and caught it. Good show. What a catch. You contained that fearsome thing in the origin ball. I still, I'm like have shivers. Like I have chills up and down. Absolutely astounding as ever, Celestria. This was so cool of a story. Thanks, Sino. Oh, just what I'd expect of my protege. <laughs> mm, yeah, yes, sniff. Oh, he's crying. Oh. <laughs> oh, that's cute. He's trying to be all tough. So even the commander sheds a tear now and then. Never thought I'd see the day. <laughs> what a sight to have witnessed. <laughs> He's so proud of me. Ouch, what gives, Commander? Not sure I deserved a sumo throw. <laughs> well, at least it seems this is no dream. Hm. Listen up, all of you. We faced a calamity unlike any we have known, but we were able to overcome it by working as one. This calls for a celebration, a festival for us all. Gather your clans. This will be the greatest celebration Hisui has ever seen. Celebrate with the Diamond Clan? The two clans together, huh? Aww. Well, since it turns out we were both following a true almighty Sinnoh of our own, I guess the times when we'd fight over whose was wrong or right are ancient history now. Because they're both right. I'm sure our ancestors would be shocked to see us agree. <laughs> but this may well be the best path toward protecting the space we all share. Aww. Let us celebrate for today's dawn a new day. For today dawns a new day. 
for all those who live in the Hisui region. Yay! Oh, this is so cute! Aww. This is so fun. This is so cool. Okay, what now? What now? What now? What's gonna happen now? <gasps> Look at her. Tell me where I came from. What? Oh, she looks back and smiles. I want to know, though. <gasps> oh! Oh, that's the end! Oh! Oh, my goodness! Oh, my goodness! <laughs> Look at this! We did it! We did it! <laughs> We beat the game! That was so, so, so good. I'm still gonna do another. I think there's like a after main story quest, I believe. And we'll do that on a, on a different stream. Um, and I'll do the cosplay. So we'll like celebrate beating the game and then we'll like play a little bit more of the game. But um, this is so exciting. Look at all of the things we went through. Eee! Look at Ken. Thank you so much for the bits. I appreciate that a lot. My goodness. Oh my gosh. You don't go back to your own time. That's what I'm wondering. Or I'm, I was thinking that I was going to explain. Um, I was thinking I was going to explain at least what happened and how I got here. Um, so cool. This was so good. Look at all of the memories. Look at all of the memories. <laughs> you should totally cosplay this character. What? Oh, I did! Nordenheim, hello, how's it going? It is on my Instagram. Uh, you might have to scroll down a little bit, but I care. I cosplayed the main, my, like, my character in this game. I did do it. Dead Teddy, hello! I wait for two seconds and she beats the whole damn game. Gotta go back, <laughs> gotta go back and start it all over. Hi Kyle, how's it going? Cola, thank you so much for the bits, I really appreciate that a lot. You guys! Oh my gosh, whenever we finish a game together, it just, like, feels so special. Like... We just like went through this whole journey together and we beat it. Now it's done and it feels all bittersweet and I'm all like sad, but like it's really exciting. You know, it like feels so like, it feels so much better that we all experienced it together instead of if I were just to beat it on my own. You know what I mean? Thank you guys for the bits. I really appreciate that a lot. This is so exciting. Um, That was a satisfying ending to me. Like some things were left unexplained, but that was definitely a satisfying ending. I loved it. I think I think this story for me is probably up there on favorite games. I loved this. Like, so much. I loved this so much. Um, Low Center, thank you so much for the bits. You guys, high train, thank you so much. <laughs> There's a bit more to the game with a true final boss. Okay. That's what I thought because that was not Arceus. Right? We still haven't met Arceus yet. <laughs> so, we're gonna continue the game, and I'll probably cosplay next time we play. Um, but yeah, that those two Pokemon were not Arceus. So, but yeah, I think there's a bit more that we can do that kind of is, is main story. It's technically more main story after the ending of the main story, if that makes sense. <laughs> yeah, it was Palkia. But in like centaur form, yeah. <gasps> Look how cute! Oh my gosh, stop. I think I'm gonna cry. <laughs> Look at how cute! I have goosebumps and I'm emotional. They were all in like festival wear and they were like hanging out and like having a good time. Oh, and celebrating. <gasps> Your arc phone is beeping. You guys, shh, 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 shh. Everybody, shh. <laughs> Seek out all Pokemon. That's it? <gasps> so I have Palkia and Dialga to take with me on my journey as I finish the Pokedex. Okay, so it wants me to finish the Pokedex. A new day dawns. Hold on. Okay. <gasps> wait. Should we do this right now or should we wait for next time? Should we just see what's out there? See if this will lead us into the next thing. Let's just do that. Let's just see what happens next. I'm excited. Let's see what awaits us for the new day dawns, or whatever it's called. That's what it said at the top of my screen. Hello, morning Celestia. Oh, this is so cute. 
So the space time rift is gone. Think this means we could finally close the book on this whole mess? Well, in any case, there's one book we can't close yet. The Pokedex. Time to get back to our official Survey Corps duty of completing it. We're going to meet in the Survey Corps office to discuss how we'll tackle the work that's left. See you there. <gasps> so fun. I love this. I love it so much. See, this this is the perfect way you you do it to keep people playing. The wrong way is Five Nights at Freddy's Security Breach. <laughs> because even though there are multiple endings to this, the first main ending that you're led to is so good and satisfying. And that makes you want to continue. It makes you want to continue playing. Okay? Instead of being forced to continue to grasp a good ending. The first one was so big and fantastic. And it leaves me wanting to play more. Okay? That's how you do it right. This is how you do it right. <laughs> this is how you do it right. This is so fun. Oh my gosh. I love it. I love this game. I'm so happy and satisfied already. Well, it did end already. But there's more. But there's more! Okay. Hello. So, I trust you enjoyed yourself at the festival. Oh, so there really was a festival. It wasn't just like a fun little painting. That's so cute! I love it! I did. Sure did! <laughs> so cute. Indeed. <laughs> that only seems natural, given the crowd. <laughs> I believe last night was the first time I've caught a glimpse of you making merry, Captain. Oh, that was Leventin saying that, not her. I believe you must be imagining things. <laughs> she let herself have fun. That's cute. Now, Professor Leventin, to business. What is the current state of progress on the Pokedex? I dare say we've made quite significant progress, all in all. <laughs> That's how he talks. <laughs> Though we could afford to put a little more effort into our research task. And of course, it is hard to know how far to go in pursuit of some reports. Certain Pokemon have only been mentioned in Hisui's legends, after all. Who knows if they're even real? Um, yeah, they're still relatively new to these parts. We're still relatively new to these parts. How are we to know what's true and what's not? Pardon, I couldn't help but overhear. Who is this? Volo! If it's Hisuian history and legends you want, then I'm your man. <laughs> so cute. Why, I've spent plenty of time studying such things instead of, ahem. I mean, while also tirelessly doing my work for the Ginkgo Guild. <laughs> and I've visited many of the ruins and whatnot here in Hisui region already. I imagine I could teach you a thing or two about any Pokemon of legend in these parts. Well, that's super fun. Oh, music to my ears, my good fellow. Listen well, Celestria. We are to learn all you can from the merchant Volo and work together as needed for the sake of the Pokedex. We, meanwhile, will also continue to gather intelligence on Pokemon by other means. Understood. I'll set up at the Heights camp then, Celestria. I'll be expecting you. Yay! Researcher of myths. Besides, I have something I'd like to discuss with you too, and I hope you won't keep me waiting. Cool beans! Okay, so we'll set up on that next time. We're gonna go back to our house and end there. Okay, we're gonna go back. Look, everything's all happy and good again. Everything's all happy and good again. Taking a stroll down the street. Okay. <clears throat> and now we're going to keep him waiting. We are. That is exactly what we're going to do. <laughs> okay, we're chilling. Yay! Oh my gosh, you guys. This was so good.